So the one thing I want you to remember, though, is on the test, you won't have the picture of what you're supposed to be getting, okay? So you can't be relying on that to tell you. Obviously, everybody can look at it now and say, yeah, that's all right. You can talk. <laughs> we, can, we can talk about, like, what happened at the door or whatever, you know? Oh, you, you always see the people coming and sharpening their pencil, huh? <laughs> Anyways, um, where were we? <laughs> oh yeah, so um, you want to be familiar with what these molecular compounds are kind of looking like without that picture in front of you, okay? So let's try, let's try N2, okay? So valence electrons of nitrogen, how many are there? Five, okay, how did I get that? I looked at the periodic table, right? Um, nitrogen likes to have one lone pair of electrons if it's uh, uncharged mo in an uncharged molecule. So what I like to do is just put that lone pair of electrons there and then just put the other three like that. Okay. Same thing with the other nitrogen. It's good to just remember that about nitrogen, oxygen, and the halogens, right? So the halogens like to have three lone pairs uh, oxygen, sulfur like to have two, nitrogen, phosphorus like to have one, okay? So it goes down three, two, one, okay? So this nitrogen here needs how many electrons? Three. This nitrogen here needs how many electrons? Three. How many does this one have to donate to this one? It has three to donate to it, okay? So, thank you. Notice the type of arrows I'm drawing. I'm not drawing arrows with two heads two-headed arrows, like everybody wants to draw, okay? Drawing just these, what we call fish hook arrows, these things uh, indicate the motion of one electron, okay? And of course, What's the charge on nitrogen? I'm sorry. Zero. Uh -uh. Yeah. It's the same thing. It means the same thing. Oxidation state and charge are the same thing. The oxidation state for nitrogen in its ionic form is negative three, if you want to think about it that way. Okay? We can build a molecule where the oxidation state of nitrogen is going to be different than zero. Let's do that. Well, it's not a molecule, it's an ion. No, I, I understand the yeah. state, but when you just say charge, I don't think it necessarily doubled. Sure, but yeah. I, 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 that's why, 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 am I, why am I asking that question? Because I know you'll mess it up, and then you'll be like, I know, I, I know, I know, you know, and then you'll know for the exam when you circle the right answer, you know? You know? Everybody cool with this? Can I? Oh, one thing, one other thing I want to do. How many electrons does nitrogen have around it? Eight. Count them. Two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Same thing with this one, right? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Got it? 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 Good. Questions? <laughs> 